<sighs> Just waiting on a crowd. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Hi, Alex. <laughs> hey, Tater Tot. Um, this is just me today. I'm not actually waiting on John, so. <laughs> oh, there's quite a few of you. Okay. Guys, I have a, a story to tell you guys, and you have all helped me out so much in the past that I'm um, going to ask you guys for a little help again today. Okay, the story goes. Um, about six months into my job, my boss had asked me to find a dry cleaning service where <clears throat> someone can come pick up our lab coats and drop them back off and blah, blah, blah. Um, so I did. And six years later, um, we still have the same dry cleaning guy. His name is Randy. Um, first time I met him, he hit it off with everyone in the office. He's one of the most kindest, sweetest people I have ever met. Um, the love he has for his family, which I've, I've learned over the six years I've, I've known him. Um, the love he has for his family, his daughters, his wife. God, it's just incredible. He's such a positive being. He's such a good soul. Um, comes in and we talk about TV shows and like he's a great conversationalist. He's just, he's a bright light. And when he comes in on Fridays to pick up our lab coats and then again on Tuesdays to drop them off, I look forward to it. I love the conversations. Um, I, I talked to John about Randy. He's just, he's an incredible person. So I think you guys get the gist. Okay, so a few weeks ago, I didn't see him. They had somebody else coming in to pick up our lab coats. Um, then he finally comes back in. I thought maybe he was on vacation or whatever. He comes back in, and I'm working away. I'm like, hey, Randy, you know, working. And I said, how are you? He says, oh, you know, I've, I've spent three days in the hospital. And that's when I looked up at him, and he looked frail. He looked white. Um, he lost a lot of weight. And I just looked at him and I was like, are you okay? He said, um, well, a few days ago I woke up in the middle of the night with, with really bad stomach pains. Um, and he says he went to urgent care the next morning and they found tumors. Sorry. <laughs> he went in for stomach pain and found out that he has stage four pancreatic cancer. And my jaw hit the floor. I feel like he's my friend. <laughs> Sorry, I'm shaky. Um, and I, I just, I don't know how to help. I had no words. Um, I could just say, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. You know, it was just really bad. And uh, I saw him again <clears throat> following week. I asked him how everything was going. Um, he says, now this is probably where I'm going to lose a lot of watchers, viewers, but, oh, okay, let me get it together. Sorry. He says his job had set up a GoFundMe for him, and I asked him if I could share it, and um, he said, yes, of course. So, uh, I've put the link in my bio. If any one of you can donate five, ten dollars, I know a lot of you guys, <clears throat> sorry, ask if um, you can help me and John. I think that Randy needs it a lot more than me and John. <sighs> um, it kind of hits close to home because he started telling me, well, he tried to start telling me that he had to tell his kids, and I, I never thought of it that way. Um, And um, I can't imagine telling my kids that I have a 4% chance of living more than five years. Um, stage four is really bad. And he, <laughs> he doesn't deserve it. I mean, obviously nobody really deserves it, but he's just such a positive person. And, oh God, I'm so sorry, guys. But if you guys can help, Please do. Just say Rachel sent me. <laughs> um, whatever you can do, $5, $10. Um, 
I'm sure he has insurance, but we all know that there's a cap and insurance doesn't cover everything because it is the United States, you know. Um, I'm sorry, Jackson's mama. Um, anyway, I'll make this short and sweet because I, I don't want to, like, pound, you know, shove this all down your throat. Um, but for anyone who has asked if you can help me and John, you can help me and John or me by helping Randy, please, 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 if you can give him $5, $10, there's a lot of you. And if you guys can just give him something, that would, that would mean a lot to me, even if it is $5. The more money he gets, I'm hoping maybe he can get some like supersonic chemo, you know, or um, something, an add-on or, or something like that. So, uh, God, so if you guys can, can help, that would be incredible. All right, who is Randy? <laughs> Randy, thank you, Big Mama. Thank you so much. Randy is um, my dry cleaning guy at work. He picks up our lab coats twice a week. Um, I've known him for six years. I've, I've been at my job six and a half years, and I've known him like about six months into my job. So he help him at least pay his bills. Yes, exactly. Um, he's taking time off of work. You know, he does have two kids, beautiful little girls. Um, and my God, he's so proud of them. I mean, he talks about them like, and his his eyes just light up. He's just, he's so proud of his family. And I cannot, I cannot imagine getting another dry cleaning guy. Like, I don't want one. <laughs> so, if you guys can help, I would really, 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 really appreciate it. And just tell him Rachel sent you, because I want him to know that I'm doing everything I can, like I told him I would. So, I'm gonna go because I'm a hot mess. <laughs> Got laundry to do anyway. Um, thank you guys so much. Again, the link, if you do want to give him $5, God, five is great, I don't care. The link is in my bio, <clears throat> on my main page. Link there, please click it. Um, thank you so much for everybody who's donating. I can see your, your comments. Um, a little known fact about me is I had cancer when I was 18. Um, luckily I didn't need chemo, I had surgery, it was removed. So, cancer is an asshole. <laughs> Sorry for kids listening, but it is. Um, doesn't care how old you are. Randy is only 38 years old, um, and he has stage four pancreatic cancer, and it's kind of like an anomaly for him because it's not even in his family. So uh, if you guys want to help me and John, please do not worry about that. We're good. Um, Randy needs us a lot more than we do. So if you can please, please, please click on the link in my bio, donate, um, that would be, that means a lot. So thank you guys so much. I'm going to stop being a little baby and I'm going to go vacuum or something. <laughs> I love you guys. Um, for those of you who are coming in late, if you can just rewatch the live again um, to catch up, I would appreciate that. Thank you everybody so much. I love you all.